Hello guys, so what's up? My name is Navneet. I am one of the product experts here at So Finance. Uh, I'll be one of the speakers who'll be taking you through this uh, Soho Finance masterclass that we have designed uh, for our uh, customers. So Finance is uh, a broad suite of uh, finance products uh, that caters to various financial needs of your uh, business, uh, right from Soho Books, which is our uh, dedicated accounting software, right up to the latest addition to our uh, products suite of products, which is Soho Checkout, which came out last year. So for the purpose of this particular masterclass series that we have been doing, we have been focusing exclusively on Soho Books, which is our dedicated cloud-based accounting software. So a very brief uh, overview of Soho Books and, and what it does, uh, it's an online accounting software that completely automates the, the money that goes in and, and goes out of your business. That's your receivables and payables. And uh, if there's any stock that you need to keep track of uh, your inventory tracking, you can easily do that. If there's a bank account that you would like to link to your uh, accounting software, you can uh, you can do that uh, within Sobooks. And uh, finally, we have a very powerful uh, reports module within Sobooks. So we have about 50 plus uh, insightful reports that you can uh, generate quite easily in Sobooks. So so if there's a business meeting with your boss or if you're traveling uh, if there's a meeting that you have to go to and you need all the data uh, very quickly uh, if your profit and loss sheets for example you want it quickly on, on your phone you can get that quite easily within a reports module in Zoho Books. Uh, the core structure for this uh, particular masterclass uh, if you've joined us before uh, you probably uh, are already familiar with this uh, me and my colleagues we have been taking you through each and every module within uh, within Soho Books. So we started off with how to uh, set up your Soho Books organization, how to go about uh, figuring out the various settings and then modules that you would like to enable. And uh, after that, uh, we went through each and every section or uh, module one by one and uh, drilled in depth uh, into how you can uh, how you can do uh, the various actions uh, within within each of these uh, modules. So we are uh, nearing the end of this uh, particular masterclass, and uh, today it's uh, it's chapter twelve of this uh, this particular uh, webinar series uh, that we have been doing for our customers. So uh, we are calling it mastering tax compliance uh, with Soho Books uh, for the US. So we'll be focusing on sales tax uh, for US and, and how ex exactly uh, you can configure that uh, within your Zoho Books organization and how is it handled within Zoho Books. So uh, with that, I go into the agenda for today. Uh, it's uh, it's a very brief session uh, today. If we have uh, tuned in before for our sessions, we have gone in depth into the different modules. Today's, today's session is going to be short. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to give you a brief pointer about setting up your uh, sales tax within your organization in the first part and uh, then we're going to conclude with uh, with uh, talking about your Avlara integration how exactly to go about doing that so with that I'm gonna take you to my Soho Books uh, organization here uh, as you can see I am right here on my uh, dashboard section uh, within Soho Books so this is this is the organization that I've uh, created already. It's an interior design firm, and it's uh, located in in California. This is the particular address uh, that I'd used to to set it up. So I'm gonna take you directly to the the taxes section. So uh, there are two ways of setting my sales tax here. Either when I create my organization itself when I sign up for Soho Books, I get an option to enable my sales tax and configure configure it. Or uh, once, I've, uh, once I've already created my organization and, and come inside my uh, taxes in settings, like what we've just done, I get an option to enable my sales tax. As you can see, I've already enabled it and uh, and uh, these are the different tax rates uh, that I already have. This is the default tax that I have. And uh, the second one is the this new tax that I've uh, that I've created within my within my Soho Books uh, account. If I want to create a, a new tax here uh, for a specific tax authority, I can I can easily do that by entering the the specific uh, information 
information here with the specific rate and and the tax authority that's that's uh, applicable uh, to me before that uh, here you can see the bunch of options uh, uh, that's that's visible when you when you click on the, the the plus button here if I want to create a new tax authority uh, I can easily do that here uh, there's an example right there for a separate region like New Jersey if I want to give that and if I want to add a description I can easily do that uh, right here so uh, once these uh, tax rates are set I can I can edit it so this is pretty self-explanatory the options are, are right there on the screen if I want to edit the tax name or the other or percentage uh, I can I can always uh, do that uh, within within so books so here you can see that the software is, is uh, giving you uh, an update the updated tax rate will uh, reflect in the in the in the in the transactions that I've already created and applied and uh, yeah basically you can select the boxes to update the tax tax rates uh, that's applicable for you uh, apart from this if I want to delete uh, an existing tax rate uh, that I've already created uh, for my organization I can I can easily do that uh, by clicking here and uh, the software will prompt me uh, will ask me for a second time if just to make sure that I actually wanna wanna delete this uh, particular tax that I've uh, already created so there are these situations in which uh, there are tax exemptions right uh, based on uh, based on the the quantity that you're selling or the location of your particular customer there are these scenarios in which uh, you are exempt uh, exempted from from taxes so uh, can see some examples on the screen there non-profit organization in some states or an NGO or medical supplies in, in specific states can be sometimes uh, tax exempt so if I want to create a tax exemption uh, within Sobooks I can uh, easily do that by clicking on this button and specifying specifying my uh, exemption reason and uh, the reason the description for this uh, particular uh, exemption So that's uh, tax exemptions for me and uh, these are the tax authorities that I've already created within my account. If I want to create a new tax authority, I can easily do that here at the click of a button. So uh, that's the tax section for you. It's it's very uh, basic and, and self-explanatory. Uh, all the steps are quite easy. Configuring a tax and adding a new tax or editing or uh, deleting or creating a tax authority, it's, it's, it's a really fast and easy process within so books so right now let's go to invoices section and uh, choose a particular uh, customer and and see what the what the software does so this is the billing address that I'd already set for this uh, particular uh, customer and uh, that's the sale tax uh, that uh, the tax specific tax that I had associated for this uh, particular customer as you can see it's been already populated for me even before I've uh, selected the, the particular item that I'm selling to this particular uh, customer so it's it's really easy it's a, it's a simple process uh, all you have to do is at the customer level itself uh, when you create a contact you have the option of uh, specifying specifying the tax that's applicable to that particular uh, customer so so that's uh, sales tax uh, within so books for you uh, the second part uh, of this uh, webinar that I wanted to talk about was the Avlara integration that we currently have in 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 uh, so books so uh, what exactly is the Avlara integration uh, it is an alternative to the manual method of uh, determining and uh, associating sales tax rates uh, to your transactions so what I just showed you was uh, creating a new contact and entering uh, the specific tax rate for this uh, particular contact manually but once I have this uh, integration in place with Avlara you wouldn't have to do that uh, manually anymore uh, all you have to do is uh, enter your specific billing address for this particular customer and after this uh, by using this particular integration the tax rate 
that's applicable for this uh, customer is automatically fetched by uh, by Soho Books. So especially for uh, rapidly growing businesses that is you know constantly gaining new customers, uh, it's not really feasible during each transaction to research and obtain obtain the right tax rate that needs to be specified. So uh, with this new Avlara integration, Soho Books uh, not only automates your final calculations but also fetches the right tax rate and uh, exemption reason for all your uh, transactions. So the first step is for you to create an account with Avlara and, and get those details, the account number, the license key and uh, enter this, uh, enter the details, the specific details here and, and you're good to go. So if you would like to set this up and if you would like more information about this, uh, uh, you can always uh, reach out to our uh, support team. You can always uh, give us a call and, and we'll be happy to uh, walk you through this. So that's me giving a very short uh, overview of the, the tax settings uh, for uh, Soho Books uh, USA edition. Uh, So uh, with that, I come to the end of this uh, particular webinar. Like I said, if there's any questions that you have uh, at any particular point with tax or, or any other uh, queries uh, regarding the product, you can always give us a call at, at this number or uh, reach out to us at support at sohobooks.com. So uh, with that, we come to the end of this particular webinar. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.